um, today I'm going to see why my camera is not focusing on me. I know that my pictures were really, really blurry last week. I am so sorry. I have another outfit of the day or outfit haul that I wanted to do for you, but um, I didn't get around to it last week and I was really bad last week um, on keeping up with my videos because I have this party on Saturday, which I did tape some of it, um, which I will show you later in this video, just a tidbit of it. <laughs> it was last night and I'm a little tired from it, but thankfully everybody left. I don't know. It, it was supposed to be a sleepover, but um, I guess I'm just not young anymore and I get so tired and I just want to go to bed. <laughs> so um, everybody left around, I don't know, maybe nine or 10 o'clock last night. So it was good. And, and we got to sing happy birthday to Haley, which, which I, she loved. She loves anybody singing happy birthday to her. And then Caitlin got, of course, a lot of gifts from my cousins. She got a lot of, um, a lot of alcohol since she turned 21 so she's just kind of looking at it like what am I gonna do with all this because it's you know it's vodka and I think um, uh, one of my cousins got her Jack Daniels honey whiskey and I think it's honey whiskey I don't know I don't drink that much so I would be the same way like oh my gosh what am I gonna do with all this <laughs> but she was very I she she didn't want to open her gifts in front of her. That's just how Katie is. She feels funny and anyways. It was a good time last night and I got to see my cousins and I got to spend time with them and I enjoyed myself. So I just, um, it was good. It was all around, it was good. So today what I wanted to show you, it's Sunday and I wanted to show you what I got um, from Macy's. Um, I don't know if this is new out, but it looked like it was new out. It's the Bare Minerals um, Redness Remedy. And it claims to take the uh, redness out of your skin, which you all know I hold a lot of redness in my skin. Um, it's to reduce facial redness on contact and over time with this incredibly effective soothing treatment powered by our 100% pure rare minerals active soil complex. It also instantly minimizes the appearance of broken capillaries, which I have in here, I've showed you, and brightens skin for a healthy looking, more even toned complexion. And it's appropriate for all skin types, including sensitive, which I do have, and includes an antibacterial treating, treated soothing compre compress brush. And this is the brush it came with. And as you can see, I've used it. Let me clean it with my brush cleaner. You can see, it's really, really, really like a, I'll show you. It came in a bottle, of course, Bare Minerals. It came in a bottle like this with the lock, the locket, um, you know how you can lock it, the locket lid. And I put a little bit in like that. And it looks almost like a mustardy color, but when you put it on, there's my brush, it's cleaner. Um, when you put it on, it um, I used it yesterday. I used it under my primer and over my under my primer and over my primer. So I put some on, and all you do is just rub it or buff. I'm sorry, don't rub. Buff it in. It smells lemony. It smells really good. It's not a really overpowering smell either. And let me do the other side because the weather is funny here. And um, I need to do something with my room to where I can utilize more light in my videos so you guys can get a very, a very good view of what I'm doing. So what you can put it all over your capillaries. I have a lot of red that runs in here. I just kind of swirled it everywhere yesterday, kind of like a um, their foundation, and it really held well well last night, especially running around and at first, you know, getting things ready and uh, 
my skin stayed really fresh looking and I was really happy because I got that ready kit which I'll show you in a minute. I know it's been around for a while. Okay. There. I turned on uh, a light and I have a little bit more light coming in this way. So it took some of the red out. I already put my primer on and I moisturized with my Murad as usual. Okay, so you can still see a little redness in here. So what I did was I just put that aside and I really have been wanting to try the Bare Minerals Ready to Go complexion. So I got the zippered kit knowing that the sizes were probably going to be small. But I just wanted to try it because lately I've really been into Bare Minerals and I said in another video that the reason I've been really into them is because my skin has never looked so good naturally. Yes, I do have a lot of redness in my skin still. Yes, I do have broken capillaries in my cheeks. That is totally hereditary. All, my mom has them, my grandfather had them. So I, I did get them. But my face has never looked so healthy as in, being smooth, being hydrated, um, not looking like a mess if I choose not to wear makeup for the day. It still has that smoothness to it. And so, oops, and once I put on that Murad that I use, the resurgence, it it tends to calm the redness down as well. So what I did was I bought the zipper pack, which I kind of like, it's kind of cute. And this is the concealer. And then of course the foundation, the mineral veil, the bronzer and the luminizer. And I don't know exactly what color I got this kit in. Let's see. I got it in, it's for medium gold skin tones, and it turned out really, really nice. With it, I also got the precision brush. Now it comes with two small brushes, a precision brush and then just a flat kabuki, but I wanted a full precision brush. Now, if you uh, are a Tarte fan like I am, and you already have a brush, it's similar to they're both the same, they work the same. But I'm gonna show you the precision brush just because, where did I put those brushes? I just, I kinda threw them in here in my drawer because I won't use these tiny little brushes. I, I need a brush, when I wanna do makeup, I wanna get it all done with. So that's the little, maybe Kabuki brush, and this is the, the performance brush. So I just keep those kind of down in my drawer, down in my drawer. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is, what I did yesterday is I took this foundation and I just took my um, Sedona Lace 941. It's just a, a, maybe a concealer brush, maybe a, just a flat brush, but I basically just went under my eyes a little bit. And as you all know, I do have the Well Rested that is a CC cream for under eyes from Bare Minerals. I got that, actually no, I bought this. I, I don't know if I got this in a kit, but it's Well Rested CC Eye Primer. And I've been using that a lot and it's not as yellow as what we have here in the kit. Although this may not be for Golden Tones, which I had um, purposely bought at Macy's. So what I did was I just took this and I just kind of covered all my red areas. It did not settle in my in my fine lines, which you know, I still have some fine lines. Yes, I do. But they're not nearly what they were. I can't say good, enough good things about that Murad. I think I might have gotten my one of my another one of my cousins hooked on it because it just I I just works so well. I never had a cleanser that worked quite that well and make my skin look it because I have I do not like leaving the house with no makeup I've told you that before I just don't feel comfortable with it you know if my hair's a mess that's fine but I have to have makeup on it's just something about me I've been like this forever 
in high school. I've just been like this since I started wearing makeup. Okay, so that is all my concealer. And you can see it knocked out a lot of the red as well. So then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take my foundation. And I know you've probably seen um, tutorials on this before, but you just take your precision uh, face brush and you just tap it in like this. And that's what you get on it. And then they want you just to rub it, buff it out. Not in swirls, just buff it out. Just like this. And, and I, I cannot lie to you and say that this precision brush isn't any good. It, It is good. I mean, it does what they say it's going to do. I, The whole kit, I mean, it... It. I like the kit, but I also like the serum now that I've learned how to use it. That was my worst enemy year, uh, when it first came out, but I like it now. So I feel like, you know, I have my matte foundation if I wanted to wear my matte foundation. I have my ready foundation if I want to wear that. And then I have my um, serum foundation. The Complexion Rescue, I'm not a fan of at all. So I don't care for that one. I tried it again last week and it it's just not what it's cracked up to be for me, you know. I don't need a lot of coverage anymore because of my face clearing up so well from the cleanser, but I need a little bit of coverage. So that is the coverage I get from the foundation. And it matches really well, even though it is a golden toned foundation. So then what I did is I went ahead and I purchased see where are you Do I have it over here so I have a you know that I love the Park Avenue bronzer this has a bronzer in it and so what I did yesterday was I went ahead and I used my gosh I can't find anything here it is I went and got this new blush at Ulta. It's called Bare Minerals. It's the Secrets Out, and it's very neutral. Kind of a pinkish, but like a maybe a mauve, maybe. And I think this would look good on just about anybody. So I'm gonna try my taking my Real Techniques power, um, blush brush, and I'm just gonna show you how beautiful that is. Let's put it you know, on, on the backs of my cheeks, going up. Make your face lift. And I just thought when I put that on yesterday, it was such a pretty blush. There's another neutral kind of one in the store that I want to get. I can't remember the name of it, but uh, Bare Minerals has come a long way since they first started. I just like this now because I don't have to wear, if I don't want to, a thick foundation. And I just, I just love it a lot. I love the fact that this feels so good on the skin and I know that it's good for my skin. Um, I know my cousin said last night she sleeps in hers and I don't know if I could go that far because I, I would think there would be makeup and everything on my pillowcase and then it'd bother me but um you know i mean if i ever ran into some some kind of problem where i had to sleep in it i guess it wouldn't be as bad as sleeping in a full coverage um, um foundation wet foundation so i'm going to take my tarte park avenue princess and what i did was i just went over Kind of, you know, under that blush like I normally do with my Tarte. It's a Tarte fan brush. I love the brushes. If you can, go to QVC when they have their Easy Pays. I know they have them today. If you can and you see some Tarte products that you like, go on there and get the products that come with the brushes. Because if you buy the brush by itself, you are going to pay more 
than if you buy the product and the brush together. It's amazing. All my brushes that I got from Tarte, which I have quite a few, have come with product. So that's how I've got a whole new brush line, which is Tarte, and I love it. I have no fallout from them. They're very nice, dense brushes. They're very soft. So I am very, very happy with them. So then what I did was I just went ahead and I took my Sedona Lace 850, it's just a contour brush, and I went in with that bronzer right here. And I didn't want to go in too dark because the bronzer that I normally use in my face palette is a lot lighter than this one. This is the one I normally use, which to me is a little bit more my you know it's just more my um my color than this one's a little dark like the warmth i i there's so many people out there that were scared of the warmth and i was one of them huh it's like oh it's so dark i am there's no way i'm going to be able to get this on my face and make it look right so i just didn't try really but um this stuff's not too bad the bronzer it's not as dark as the um, the the bronzer uh, warmth. It's not as dark, and you know some people really like the warmth, and some people just like me just kind of shied away from it. So I'm going to take the bronzer on my Sigma Large powder brush, and I'm just going to go down my neck just to blend it all in. And I blended out my contour. And see my Sigma brushes? They always shed, and I hate that. I hate that. So then you have your luminizer. And so I'll take my Bare Essentials. It's just a seamless blending brush. And I'm just going to take that luminizer, and I'm just going to really lightly, because I'm not a real big, big luminizer fan, and I'm just going to kind of go over my blush, a little down my nose, and on my Cupid's bow, which it's very light. So that is my face makeup. Now, as you can see, I have no redness in my face whatsoever. It has all been banished. So I am really, really happy, and I only went over it one time yesterday, I did twice, of this redness remedy. And it says that over time the redness will diminish and, and the capillaries, and that's what I'm really hoping for because I, like I said, I, um, my face is the way I want it. It hasn't been like this in a really, really, really long time. And um, I owe it to the Murad Resurgence and I know I say that in almost every video, but really, truthfully, my, my skin has never been in such great condition. And my fine lines and everything have been um, just diminishing. My skin looks healthy. Um, it just has an overall healthy look. I'm still using this Pure Transformation Night Treatment. It's made a huge difference. Yes, it's $60. But I'm telling you, if you can get this on Easy Pay through QVC, which I got this, I think I just ordered, ordered it from Macy's one time, not too long ago. Get it. it it's, worth the, it's worth the investment. It has made a huge difference in my pores. I've always had pore problems. Look, look, look up close. Now you are up close on top of me, okay? Look at my skin. If you want to compare that, go back to my first videos and look at my close-ups in my other videos. You will see a huge, huge difference. My pores always poke out and say hello. I've always had a problem with pores. I am not using any pore refining thing. Um, well, I am. Okay, that was a lie. I am using something to help my pores. I still do the professional. I need to get a new tube. This is just a little, a little sampler. But um, I do use this after my moisturizer. I put this on, um, and then I put the redness remedy over that, over my capillaries, and you saw where I put it. So that is my video for today. I. Um, 
I'll try to put some a bit of the party if the video is not too long. Um, and uh, tomorrow I'm going to bring you something else that I got from Ulta. It's a brand new Just Out Tarte um, eye palette and cheek palette. So I will see you tomorrow. Please like and subscribe um, to my video and share it. I would just totally, totally be thankful for that. Bye, everybody. Teach Dylan how to you, man. Cousin's going through makeup. It's a bit different than the first Yay! One. It's not that hard. So cool. Is that a poker? No. Yeah. Yeah. This shows attack and defense. Yeah. What's their health? And they don't get, it doesn't show their like their moves and stuff. That's like so, Christmas. Yeah. I know it's so you exciting. No, I have them. my I have what, my. Can you pass me no. my purse roots? No. Oh, do you? I have yeah. my, uh, no, they don't have a specific. Brush. Brush. Yeah. Oh really? You see uh, those Try numbers on. at the bottom where yeah. it says ATK. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Attack and defense. Another? Yeah. Got a brush. They don't have a specific move. I have tons of brushes upstairs that I don't use. What is that? What kind of brush is that? Um, I got some icing, but it works because none of the brushes come out. Uh, yeah. And it was five dollars. That's cool. We're doing a video. They're all doing a review. Can I do it too? Sure, honey. I think Tony wanted in on a piece of this. Tony wanted the BB cream. And the cards just do the damage. The defense and the damage. Paul's looking at me like, what? That okay. is my wife's name right now. I have a 1600 and I attacked her 2000 defense. Yeah. I get at least 400 damage. Medium. Okay. Because you're medium. If it's a tie between 1600 and 1600, you know, they both knock each other out. They both get destroyed. But if anybody wants to bring in the damage. That's for like a, a skin finish no, that's um, after you put on your liquid foundation. The cards, the trap cards, and then there should be a blotting powder in there too. You can use that as a highlighter. It actually might trap cards are for luring people in. That's what I do. I, need to have I, have, I have one trap card. Well, we'll have a highlighter and concealer. This is my kids' birthday party. We're all talking makeup. And it can do half the damage of each monster. And there's my sign and my cousin Mike in the background. So let's say we have and my husband, and he has cups. Yeah. All that combined is 1,500, 1,500, and then three, 1,000.